Oof, oh, oh, that was a close call, my oh my. Okay, welcome to the visitor center. Excuse me, can I have your attention please? Yes, you there playing with your phone. Can I have your attention? <laughs> Thank you. As I was saying, welcome to my home. My name is Professor Sealand, and I'm here to tell you a bit about our sea, the Mediterranean Sea. It's my home, and I'm hooked on the pleasure of hosting you in the depths of a clean Mediterranean Sea. Allegedly. <laughs> what can I do? Cry about it? <laughs> okay, uh, where was I? Ah, yes, the Mediterranean. So, let's head out. Uh, that is, dive down. No? Well, we did come here to learn something. We'll see you later. The Mediterranean Sea is divided into two basins the Western Basin and the Eastern Basin. An underwater mountain ridge between Sicily and Tunisia divides these two basins. As we move eastward along the Mediterranean, we experience increased temperature and salinity and a decrease in nutrients. Because of the Mediterranean's geohistory, most of the local marine species originated in the Atlantic Ocean, and the further east one moves, the number of species decrease. The Mediterranean Sea is considered an almost landlocked body of water, connected on the east to the Atlantic Ocean by way of the Strait of Gibraltar, and in the east to the Indian Ocean by way of the Suez Canal and the Red Sea. The Mediterranean Sea is nearly 4,000 kilometers long, 800 kilometers at its maximum width, and has an average depth of 1,500 meters. Although the surface area of the Mediterranean Sea is only about eight-tenths of a percent of the world's ocean surfaces, its nearly 17,000 marine species comprise six to seven percent of all scientifically known species. Most of these species are concentrated in coastal areas and continental shelves up to a depth of 200 meters. The southeastern edge of the Mediterranean Sea, from the line of islands between Crete and Rhodes, up to the coast of Israel, is known as the Levantine Sea. Water temperatures in the Levantine Basin vary between 16 to 18 degrees centigrade in winter, up to 30 degrees centigrade in the summer months, and climatically speaking is considered a subtropical region, while the western Mediterranean is considered a warm temperate sea. Wow! No, how was it? <laughs> Didn't I tell you it would be interesting? I hope you learned something and are wiser for it. That's all for now. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.